Hello, fellow seekers on the path to enlightenment and spiritual freedom. Today I'm bringing you a powerful exploration into the realm of spiritual warfare, specifically focusing on demon exorcism. Yes, it might sound a bit intense, but these are tools given to us through ancient wisdom that can help cleanse spaces and minds. Let's delve into five biblical prayers known for their potency in casting out demons. First, we turn to Psalm 91, a shield of protection. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. This prayer is a fortress, providing safety and asserting divine presence as a barrier against all forms of evil. Next, we look at the Lord's Prayer from Matthew, June 9th, 13. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Simple yet profound, this prayer encompasses a plea for protection and deliverance from all malevolent forces, a staple in daily spiritual hygiene. Moving on, Luke, October 17th, 20, offers reassurance of the power bestowed upon us. I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy. Nothing will harm you. This passage empowers believers, affirming that spiritual authority over demons is granted to those who follow the path of righteousness. Fourth, we have Mark 9, 25, where Jesus himself confronts an unclean spirit. You deaf and mute spirit, I command you, come out of him and never enter him again. It's a direct and assertive command that embodies the authority to rebuke evil. Lastly, Ephesians June 11, 18 instructs us to put on the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes. This isn't just a prayer. It's a call to be spiritually equipped to always be ready to face and stand firm against the spiritual adversities of life. In embracing these prayers, remember it's not just about the words, but the faith and intention behind them. They are tools, yes, but their true power is unlocked by your belief and the purity of your spirit. May you find strength and protection in these words. Thank you for joining me today. Keep seeking, keep believing, and stay protected on your spiritual journey.